Good morning all. This is the Burlington High School in Burlington, Vermont. It is contaminated with polychlorinated biphenyls, also known as PCBs, and will be demolished in January 2023. I've been granted special permission by Tom Flanagan, superintendent of schools at the Burlington School District, to film the interior of a building, only a building. This is a building right here. Frankly, uh, probably the most dynamic of the buildings. It houses the auditorium, the cafeteria, the gymnasium, the music room, the music de and orchestra departments, and um, uh, the, the principal's office. It has a lot of the, this is the main entrance to the school. Now I've been granted permission to film the auditorium, the gymnasium, and the cafeteria. So that's pretty exciting. The, uh, I will have a, I'll be with a representative of the Burlington School District and uh, super excited about that. Now, let's be clear, this does not look like a high school as we would know it with, with the desks and chairs and all that stuff. I don't expect it to. This is a snapshot in time from December 30, 2022. So I don't want you to get your hopes up on that. But, um, but yeah, that's exciting. By the way, this bell from uh, from a, an earlier rendition of a Burlington High School will be preserved. So I'm super excited about that. I was, uh, and and they're also saving different um, plaques about different uh, teachers and whatnot. And as you may recall, there's a a plaque over here uh, dedicated to uh, Paul Daniel. Mr. Daniel was my principal when I was a student here and I have a video because I found his grave and um, he's buried in the village cemetery in Shelburne, Vermont. And on that note, let's um, let's go in and, and take a look see, shall we? All right, see you inside. All righty, well this is the cafeteria and uh, I always knew this space was huge and wow, I mean, huge. <laughs> now when I was here, they used those long, brown, heavy tables. And uh, nowadays they use these round tables, which seat eight and, and uh, keeps the room actually quieter as opposed to students shouting down the table to their friends or to whomever. And we like quieter. I can tell you that. Now they have um, these boards on the windows due to vandalism. Ugh. Sorry to hear that. Love the paintings on the wall. And please correct me, but I don't remember anything like this when I was in uh, high school. So for my fellow graduates from the 80s, do you remember this stuff? This is newer anyway, but uh, do you remember any of that stuff? Now, there's, this was a bistro area over here. They have a culinary arts program. Um, I believe they're discontinuing that. But here they had the culinary arts program. This, if you're wondering, this is a freezer, which they're going to disassemble. And as, this, each is, as, as schools in the school district have freezers that break down, they have, um, I think, three of these to uh, break down and give to whatever school has a broken freezer. Love the stainless steel walls, or stainless steel uh, attachments to the walls. It keeps things, um, well, more sanitary, certainly. And, um, And if you bang into it with a cart, it doesn't damage anything. I remember going through the lines, who doesn't, to get food. Wow. Well, you know the drill. You know the social media stuff, I know you do, but for those who are new to my channel, I'm on all the social media you are. I'm traveling for history one Ellen traveling on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, 
instead of my YouTube channel. But on uh, Twitter, I'm traveling for high one, traveling for HI numeral one. So follow me anywhere you'd like. I'd appreciate it. Subscribe to my channel. I would love that. And until I see you again, this is Patricia, and I am traveling for history. Thanks so much for watching. Truly appreciate it. Bye.